Today's video will be about the global topical search capability in EasyStamp. This is extremely useful, especially for topical collectors. I recently had a call from a collector who collects all stamps from any country, which was issued on his and his wife's birth year, which was 1958 and 1962. He had asked if there was a quick way to find all those stamps from those uh, from any country and inventory them or put them in a want list. And the answer is yes, and, and here's how. So we'll use the power search feature to find the stamps, and uh, let's get started. Uh, I'm using the uh, global edition of Easy Stamp for this demonstration, which currently has every country covered completely with about 827,000 stamps listed and about 451,000 images that are uh, in the Easy Stamp database. So let's get started. With uh, Easy Stamp open, any country, it doesn't really matter. Right now I'm, uh, I've got Albania open. We go to search and we'll select power search. And then I'm going to recall my last search. So we will set the criteria uh, based on on what this particular collector uh, was looking for, but you can send it uh, set it any way that you like. So we're going to do a search for the year issued uh, for 1958 and a search for 1962 so that this will cover uh, both ranges. And notice how I used a level one or level two match. Now we will click on the global button and this will allow us to select the countries that we want to search. In this instance we're going to select them all and I've included all the countries here. And then we'll click here and click OK. So now what it's going to do is it's going to um, search all the countries that meet the criteria that we've uh, we entered. This usually takes about oh about a minute or so, depending on the speed of uh, of your machine. Once the search is completed, uh, we can see the results in the list viewer, or we can switch back and forth to the thumbnail viewer. We're about uh, about halfway done here. We'll just let it finish. Keep in mind that it's going through and searching. Uh, over 800,000 stamps right now. So we're almost done there. Okay, so it found 7,669 stamps that meet the criteria. So we'll click on show. As you can see, it's found quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of entries. Now you can switch back and forth between the list view and the thumbnail view. We'll stick in the the search the 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 list view for now. Now you can save the results for for uh, quick recall at any time, so you don't have to keep repeating the searches. You can also inventory the stamps quickly using the tie-in to our rapid multi-entry process. You can also put the results into the report view so you can add to the priority want list. And we'll do each of those. So let's, uh, let's inventory the stamps from Argentina as an example. So we'll scroll down here and we'll find, uh, let's see, I'm sure, there we go. So if we want to inventory these stamps from Argentina, what we can do is we'll select them all so we can just drag all those and then we'll click on this green icon down here now notice that as you hover over any of these icons anywhere in easy stamp it actually will tell you what it's going to do on the status bar so if you hover over the green check mark it says add the selected stamps to your inventory which is what we're going to do so you click the green check mark and that brings up the rapid multi entry so let's say you had all these stamps in Mint Never Hinged Very Fine. You select the grade and you click Begin. And now we've just added 32 stamps to our inventory, those 32 stamps. Let's, um, now I'll show you how to uh, 
add some of these stamps to let's say the priority want list so let's scroll down and add the stamps let's say of Australia and we're gonna choose a bunch here and I'm gonna say okay I want I want to I, I want to get these I don't have them and I, I'd like to uh, purchase them so what you can do is we have to transfer the results to the report viewer and you do that by clicking here on the R icon which transfer all the records to the report viewer so it's now entered all these stamps into the report viewer we're going to select them all and we're going to click on this uh, rapid multi-entry um, sorry the uh, the priority want list icon which is the shopping cart so if you click on that icon here let's say you want to buy these as mitt never hinged very fine and then we say add to priority want list so there's those 30 stamps were added to the priority want list we'll close that up and then we can go and uh, view that priority want list and I'll show you how to do that but what I want to show you now is how to actually save this search so that you do not have to rerun it every time and the way you do that is you click on this X icon down at the bottom which exports the results so if you click on here it'll ask you for a name and I'm gonna type uh, 1958 plus 1962 and we'll just save that and we'll close this result and now we can go to the priority want list and there's 30 so these are all the stamps that we added into the priority want list for Australia so now let's say you wanted to recall that search again and you didn't want to rerun the search. All you have to do is you go to View, Global Search Results, and it remembered the last search that we did. But if you had saved multiple ones, like for example, I've run a search for uh, Gandhi. So if I click on the I for Import, you open that one up, and now these are all... Um, I'm pretty sure India will have a ton of all right, so these are all related to Gandhi and it all functions the same if you wanted to uh, load up the search I did for um, let's say Olympics you open that and there you go and you can again you can see everything in thumbnail viewer so you can just scroll back and forth now I use this feature all the time when I'm searching for stamps, especially uh, stamps for my daughter who collects flowers on stamps. And when I have time, I'll, I'll go in and search for stuff and see if I can find them. So to recap, if you're a topical collector, Easy Stamps Global Search is extremely comprehensive and just a few clicks away. Enjoy!